Hi sis, welcome to Five Chic Mothers. My name is Doris. I am so excited to bring you this video today. How are you doing? So um, before we start and I give it up about what the video is going to be about today, I want to show you my outfit of the day. That was a request from a sis um, previously. So I am bringing you our vintage. I just love this jacket. I actually bought it from a thrift store, which let me tell you, whenever I saw that Aztec, afro prints ethnic i'm all for it and the colors and the strings so yeah this is what i'm bringing you today you can tell and i love myself a good sharp shoulder and then i'm wearing a velvet vintage dress as well underneath it so all vintage today and for my shoes i am bringing you some zara goodness i bought those boots on sale and I actually have those black boots, but without the chain link. Whenever I saw this version, I was like, oh my goodness, this is so good. I need it. So I got it on sale at Zara um, online and for like maybe 40 bucks. So very affordable. Yeah. So now we got this out of the way. Let's talk about this video. So today for this video, I want to show you a few of my most fabulous vintage blazers. I am so into blazers because they can elevate your look and you can wear them with anything, with jeans, with dresses, with skirts. And I was like, you know what? Let me show my sis, you know, how fabulous, you know, of the blazers you can find at the thrift store. So for the first blazer I want to show you, it is this gorgeous pink blazer look at this so beautiful and i got it for probably five dollars at the most at goodwill oh look at the lapels the, ja the lapels just did it for me oh my goodness i love it so much and i think it's linen and the brand says pop off it's vintage so yeah let me try it on for you sis i love trying on stuff if you haven't noticed <laughs> let me do that oh my goodness so good look at this need i need i say more look at this goodness wow so good i'm telling you for just five dollars zara has got nothing on this the finishing touches everything is on point look at this you can wear this with anything with jeans with a dress with a skirt look how the lapels meet over here sis i love this so much you can wear this one i mean anywhere church school work it's up to you if you want to look glamorous and chic go for it so whenever i put on the um the buttons that's how it looks like and i love the length as well if i step back you can tell how long it is and i love it i think it's just it's so it's just so good so fab i love it so yeah this is your first blazer and ah look at the shoulders and if you're not into shoulder pads you can remove them always so there's no problem to it but I love me a good sharp shoulder. Look at that. <laughs> oh, I think it's exquisite. I love, love, love this blazer. Yeah, so that's the first blazer I wanted to show you. And you can tell with a vintage, with button, it's so cool. Yeah, it's like, call me Professor Doris. <laughs> oh my goodness and i'm telling you whenever you wear like such a fab blazer you get into a persona it's like you have so much confidence you exude such ah, such a vibe honestly ah love it love it love it love it so the second blazer i'm going to show you is this so you should have seen this one in one of my recent hauls like vintage blazer um haul and I love me a good plaid. Look at this, the goodness of it. It's so rich and so vibrant. And the um, the velvet lapel, uh, not lapel, um, the velvet color, just do it for me. I love it, love it. It's not just a regular um, blazer. 
Ah, look at this. Let me try it on for you. And of course, I thrifted this one as well. And uh, such goodness. Let me see. We're done with this one. And let's try on the next one. Ah, oh, so good. Look at this. Ah, oh, yes. It's giving me chic English vibe. Just, you know, timeless elegance. Look at that. If I step back, you can see it's a little bit long, which I love. And it goes with anything. Look at that dress. That's why I wanted to wear like a black dress as a Canva to showcase all of the, um, the blazer. So you can see how it looks with some jeans, with some culottes, with some palazzo pants. I mean, anything goes well with it. Wow. I love it. So, so good. So good. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying it as well as as much as I am because for me this is like a treat to be able to try on clothes and blazers and look chic and fabulous. Oh, love it. So the third blazer is this rich goodness here that we have. Again, the Aztec, Afrocentric, ethnic print get me every time you can see oh when i saw it and literally i have that, that gasp when i'm going to be wax i'm like oh! <laughs> that's what i do and then i look around hopefully nobody heard me <gasps> when i saw this one i was like are you kidding me and this is a linen and the brand is linda a lot ellen tracy this is a linen as well and it fit me i was like yes thank god this is so gorgeous let me try it on for you i'm telling you, i amuse myself at the store whenever i find something so fabulous oh yes oh wow yes oh I really hope you can catch the vibrant color, uh, the patterns, the, the shape of it, the structure. If I step back, you can see. Oh my goodness, so good. So good. Ah, uh, I'm telling you. Do they call me Professor Doris? That's all I'm saying. I feel like a professor. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I love this so much. Look at this. So classy. And one tip also, because here you can tell that the, um, the sleeves are a little bit shorter. So I like to fold them up once. So, you know, it looks good. And actually the lining comes out, so it adds more color as well. Oh my goodness, I love it. Look at this, so cute. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you like it, honestly, because I love it so much. And if you like it, sis, come on, subscribe to this channel. We've got to connect. We, we have so much good fashion videos in store. You don't want to miss out on any of them, do you? Oh, look at that. Got to move on, though. Got to move on. <laughs> so the next one I wanted to show you is this wool. Um, I think it's a, it's a plaid, I think, plaid blazer, which I showed you in the haul um, last year, and I love this color. I love the orange, you can tell here, oh yeah, orange, pink, gray, I love the mix of colors, and one thing is, I love colors, so... I'm not the um, neutral type of person. I can wear neutral, but I love me some good colors. I'm really bold in my um, fashion choices that way. So if you're not, maybe that's something you want to experience. 
or experiment this year to expand your your style your fashion aesthetics oh yeah and this one is so warm i can literally tell i feel warm wow look at that wow look at the lapels look at the shoulders and the dress already has shoulder pads and i think the jacket also has shoulder pads so if you even want a sharper shoulder giving people some grace jones <laughs> shoulders hey you can wear something that already has shoulder pads on top of a blazer with shoulder pads why not i love it the structure it gives you i mean i look dressed up right away with a simple dress underneath it i already look dressed up i'm ready to go put some boots on some tennis shoes on a bag a cute purse you're good you don't need much to really feel dressed up and to look your best and on a budget for five bucks and some of them even for four dollars i don't remember the prices but yeah oh love this one and one tip you can also add a belt it's up to you if you like to cinch your waist you can add a belt and be looking even more like bam <laughs> I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Oh, love it so much. Let's move on. <laughs> I have this plaid vintage blazer that I think I showed you in one of my recent hauls last year. And this is one of my favorite, for real. For real. I love it so much because i can literally picture myself wearing like a white dress or you can wear like a white pair of linen pants underneath it a white bodysuit and look so chic so expensive let me tell you sis this blazer business you've got to get into it if you're not before because to look chic and fabulous you don't need much money you just need to know what you need and wear something that fits you. Ah, oh, look at this. Ah, oh, come on now. Come on now. When I step back, you can see the length. And I think one of the thing is, this is my perfect length. I just love it when it goes down, um, when it goes past your, your bum. I like it a lot ah oh, because then if you actually want to add like a belt it doesn't ride up all the way I love it so much <laughs> I'm telling you I love it let me get close so you can see so good so good let me tell me um in the comments which one is your favorite uh, so the next one we have is this oh my goodness double breasted double breasted vintage blazer and this one is a um a houndstooth oh i love me a good houndstooth and this one is tiny tiny so ah oh, such a such an exquisite blazer let me try it on and the thing is if you even have five good blazers you can mix and match your pieces and uh, you got outfit for for months honestly you don't need to have too many of those it's just because you know your sis likes thrifting that she's collecting those but you don't need that many if you have five good blazers like what a white one a black one um red um a plaid one you know beige also will go well with things you'll be set look at that look at that i love me the structure and this one is you can tell how it's, it comes in and goes out look at that 
so good it actually reminds me of um a brand called the frankie shop and i saw a lot of youtubers um buying their blazers well for much much more money <laughs> and i got it right here for five dollars at the most look at that so exquisite so timeless so chic oh i love it and you can even put on the um the buttons if you want to button it up it's up to you or you can leave leave it open and let it swing oh my gosh i love it so much like i'm rediscovering my blazers as i'm filming this video because a lot of times we just let things sit in our closet we're not sure what we have but oh i'm falling in love all over with them again and sis i think after this video i'm heading to goodwill i think i am good stuff to be <laughs> to be gotten <laughs> oh i love this one so much and this one is looks very professional very sharp and if you long if you actually want to look more, more bougie guess what you even leave the colors like this blazers vintage blazers okay now this black vintage blazer is so one of a kind sis. look at this i'll get closer so you can see they actually added some pearls and some diamonti pearls and diamonds do you see actually how it shimmers i'm not sure how you can see it but look you cannot find this in fast fashion even if you find it it's not going to be as durable as well made than those here oh oh my gosh talk to me talk to me about the monochromatic all black look look at that look at that <laughs> look at this sharpness over here I love it. I love it. Wow. The lapels. Look at this. Oh my goodness, the shine out of this world, out of this world. <laughs> oh my love, I love it so much, so much. And even look at the button. I mean, the details on vintage blazers. Oh, I don't think you can see it. Even the buttons. Let me tell you, you own any room you walk into these outfits you own any room you walk into confidence is yours <laughs> oh my goodness i love this one so so much wow all the way we're back it's worth it it's worth it for four dollars five dollars i don't know what to say anymore i hope you're catching my vision right now i i, I hope you're catching it <laughs> okay so the next one sis sis <laughs> look at this house look look at that bam bam oh okay let me oblige <laughs> oh my goodness oh oh my gosh this one is just perfect 
perfection. I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to say. It's not just a typical houndstooth blazer, but the color block effect with a yellow. Like you really want to be walking and like in the matrix, just we went just <laughs> the breeze is going to like blow your blazer back so people can see. <laughs> you know you want to be walking like this. <laughs> I love it. Who have thought adding yellow to a hand stove blazer would be so original? And fabulous, it is fabulous. It is chic, it is modest. Honestly, this is me right here. The length, perfect. The oversized effect, perfect. Look at this. Perfect. Shoulder pads, check. Fabulous button, check. Accent pockets, check. Fabulous lapels, of course. Check. <laughs> oh my goodness, let me put on um, the button so you can have an effect. I forgot to read you the brand. I'll read you the brand after I'm done. Yeah. Look at that. And I think for this type of blazer, I think I like the black dress underneath it because I really want to go somber, you know, because I really want the blazer to do the talking. Not too much information, just a blazer to do the talking. So I think like a black dress or just some simple jeans or a white, something white or black, something solid underneath it is going to really make it pop more. I mean, this is so sophisticated, classy elegant i don't know what else i don't know what else look at that i love to wear them open actually i don't know what else oh let me read the brand so maybe you can go to poshmark 209 by barbara green hopefully you can see it oh my goodness shall we continue shall we <laughs> oh my lord gorgeous so of course i think this is a hound's too yeah i got another blazer here that i got i little remember last year i was so like excited when i saw it so what attracted me to this blazer so many different aspects let me get closer so you can see I just love the uh, the brown and aubergine color and look at that the elbow pouch over here suede beautiful and then whenever you open the vest the jacket there's a vest in the it. so I got a I paid five dollars to have a blazer and a vest underneath it listen only at the thrift store only at the thrift store so you can tell this is a regular vest let me tell you whenever you wear this i call it some english goodness <laughs> look at that so i can literally wear the vest with other outfits and then wear the blazer with other things or bring it all together and looking chic let me pair it both together so you can see and i think for it to work you need to button the vest it's such an interesting visual effect i feel like look at that <laughs> Look 
can't tell me I don't look rich. Like, oh, I'm going to a cottage house, you know, this weekend to my ranch, you know, ride some horses going on. Look at that. Look at that. draw a string so chic i literally see somebody riding with it you know um riding pants riding boots looking so chic i love this i love this combo together oh yeah so even if you decide to wear you know to button it up people can still see the vest on the it. So how do you like this piece? I love it. It's just so original. It's just so chic. Look at that. <laughs> I'm telling you. I'm going thrifting after this. I am going thrifting after this. Let's move on to the next one. <laughs> okay. Such great pieces, I'm telling you. And I have, I have many more, but I was like, you know what? Let me just give my sis an, an excerpt, a sample. Because <laughs> if I actually want to bring out my whole collection, this video is going to be how many hours long? <laughs> so yeah, so you'll see the other blazers whenever I'm doing lookbooks or in other videos. So the next blazer I wanted to show you is this one right here i just fell in love actually i got this one from the men's section so also do not neglect the men's section so many goodness goodness over there um so this is technically a men blazer which i just love the oversized the khaki color i mean look at that i love the cowboy pardon do it i think it looks fabulous I, I really like this look at this buttons actually could it be a men's blazer with the buttons i don't think so oh that's interesting it was in the men's section though oh. look at that so fabulous so fabulous I love it. I love it so much because it has nothing to do. Doesn't look much like my um, my other blazers I have. You know, khaki, beige, off white colors. This one is very structured. I just love the sharp lapel. Look at this the um, the vintage pockets over here. This like it comes straight out of the seventies, the eighties. I love it so much. I love it. Let me try to put on one button to give you the full effect of it i like this one so much and i think to have a versatile wardrobe it's good to have different types of um of blazers for different occasions oh this one is so good so so good and if you're looking for oversized blazers sis go to the men's section i'm telling you most of my fabulous blazers that i didn't showcase today i actually got them from the men's section so it's a treasure trove over there oh love it i love it and we've seen fast fashion replicates this um this style for years now and uh this is timeless this is like a blazer for real this is like a regular blazer that you have forever and ever love it okay the next one i'm going to show you both ah, i love it <laughs> i love it so so much are you ready for it bam look at this look at the color blocking and I, I don't need to talk look at the color blocking look at this the green the blue 
the white, the beige khaki color. Oh my goodness. And this was from Donnybrook, you can tell, made in Ukraine, size 14. That was one of my um, silliest gasping moments at the store when I saw this. I was like, ah. <laughs> oh my gosh, I was so pleased. Oh my goodness. Okay, just who could have thought? Look at this, the sleeves. Ending with a green, ending with a blue. The color blocking is perfection. The length, perfection. The, the pockets, the side pockets, the lapel, the contrast between all the different colors, yet they go so well together. Look at that. Yet they go so well together. And the back, I mean, come on now. Shut the front door. Shut the front door. And I can literally see myself wearing this. I actually have a pair of khaki linen matching this color here so can you imagine oh i need a lookbook on this i need a lookbook on this sis <laughs> a white bodysuit a pair of linen pants you just stand there like a tourist with your sunglasses on and people see you like ma'am may we help you like <laughs> looking like a rich auntie Look at that, because we're rich. Over here, we only profess good things, right, over our lives. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. I mean, everywhere you look, it's like amazing. This is amazing. You just enter the room like this. Oh, so this is one of my all time favorite blazers. Beautiful, beautiful. And it needs nothing. I don't feel like I need a belt over it. I don't really feel like I need a belt. It's just perfect the way it is. The cuffs, perfect. It doesn't need anything. It's just perfect. Just perfect the way it is. Look at that. And anybody coming to you, where did you get that blazer? Sorry, printed it. Or you don't want to say printed, it's up to you. No, this is vintage. This is vintage. But for me, yeah, I am I have no shame in my game. I'm a thrifter. And I take great pride into finding those gems for next to nothing. So I tell people, goodwill. <laughs> I'm not too bougie like that. I'm like, goodwill. <laughs> yes. Oh, love it. Ah, oh, next. We have got to move on, unfortunately. I can talk about this one forever. So the next one I want to show you, now we have the last two uh, white blazers because it's, it's a really easy mask. This vintage white blazer here is beautiful. I love the asymmetrical lapels, you can tell. And this like satin, the borders. Oh, the buttons. You have got, hopefully you capture the buttons. The buttons are literally small, small pearls added to it. Now, the bottom part of it is what makes this blazer. They literally added, you know, those leaves, um, details, they literally added some more. It's not beads. Yeah, I think it's some um, some pearls. 
okay golden pearls to it so this layering of goodness on goodness on goodness is like goodness overload for real oh yes shoulder pads i love how different this one was i was like this is original this is awesome and of course i got it so yeah let me get closer so you can see you see this you can even hear oh so good so good and that it actually gives you a peplum effect because of the bottom and then when you turn it stops right here only vintage i mean those creators gorgeous i love it it's fabulous it's just fabulous anywhere you go you'll stand up because it's not just a regular white blazer it's not a regular white blazer it's got so many interesting details and of course you can add some um, modern pieces oh love it love it love it love it so good the bottom part is like my goodness so many interesting details to it love it okay last but not least i think you love you love the last one i love it so much okay sis look at that bam look at this beautiful just beautiful i got it we went on um on a holiday trip to miami and i think i went to one of the goodwills there and i was like that's that's one thing whenever you're taking a road trip or you go on vacation hey go explore the three stores you want you know the places in the city where you are because you'll find some gems from cachet vintage let me put it on for you oh oh look at that that feeling of wearing something luxurious like seriously oh my goodness and this one has a big pad which i love and my dress also has a small shoulder pad to it so it's um the shoulder pads are exaggerated because of that but i love it i love it so much look at that You get closer so you can better see the stars golden stars like patches or embroidery i think they added look at that look at that and here let me lift it up half the sun the pockets where can you find something like this so fabulous these days where Zara's got, I mean, honestly, no, this is unique. This is one of a kind. So gorgeous. And this one, I think I got for $10 and it was worth it all the way. Worth it. Look at that. Look at that. So chic. So, so chic. Oh, let me tell you. You can wear this in so many different ways that, ah, oh, I love me a good vintage, fabulous blazer. And I hope that at the end of this video, this is what you have um, gained from it, that you can find so many fabulous blazers at the thrift store. And it doesn't have to be good way of a savers. There's those little holes in the wall, thrift stores, you know, sometimes that you really do not assume they have much. But let me tell you, vintage goodness can be found in those unassuming places. 
um, a lot of churches even have um, thrift stores inside the church. So there is a, there's no sort, there is no shortage of thrift stores and take advantage of it. Not only you can look chic, fabulous, but also you can be saving money, honestly. You can be frugal and still look chic and fabulous. And I'm telling you, you go anywhere, there is like less chances of anybody wearing what you're wearing just because you thrifted it and it's vintage yep so um one last walk <laughs> i can do this all day sis. so um ah such goodness i hope you enjoyed this video sis and uh there's so many more fashion videos to come and please do not forget to subscribe and like this video share it we want to grow this community and take care of yourself and god bless you we'll see you soon bye